Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Cade Plays Terminator Resistance. We are back in Dr. Mac's laboratory. And we must never forget the sacred mission that was entrusted to us by Commander Baron. This man may not walk out of this bunker here today. We shall see if I feel merciful. I've got the codes. All right, then let's get right. To All right, let's do it, Doc. Quest updated the Hitman. Please insert stolen security codes. All right. Strike a key. Waiting for my opportunity to and kill this punk. Like they say, easy money. There we go. That's it. With the proper equipment, it only takes oh, Of course it does. We can fight Skynet with our own weapons. Slightly I more hair-having Steve well. Buscemi. The first prototype just came out a couple of days ago. Okay. Imagine what happens if they become mass-produced. Yep, we definitely don't want happens. too many infiltrator units. That, infiltrator has been that would be a, a problem. Days. That it's would lead me for that would lead to some kind of the movie can't. Terminator that situation. Out for mere days. It's the same model that destroyed Pacific Division. Yeah, this uh I'm connected to Skynet's That thing's been around for a while, but I'm telling you that what you're saying is not possible. Unless Unless what? Tell me, nerd. Tell me your secrets. Oh they will do it. They will finish the TDE. What's the TDE? Finish what? TDE, time displacement equipment. Aha! Purposes, it's a time machine. A time machine? This all just got yes, a whole a lot more machine. Terminator. You go in, you pick a date, you press a button, and just like that you'll be watching your younger self learning to tie your shoelaces. You know, time, time travel. travel. Uh, the curse of this franchise. The central conceit of this franchise, progress, and yet its, it's most horrible happened. curse. So how could they send anyone back if it's not ready? They didn't, but they will. Don't you see? In one alternative future, they finished oh, the God. Okay. Terminator back to our times. This is that getting very Terminator. Small. You couldn't have seen it otherwise. It didn't exist yet. That so, in another time loop, they already completed... They already completed the time displacement equipment and sent the Terminator back so to come kill me. Done, what the fuck can we do now? We can still fight for this future. Our future. You could stop Skynet before they finish... You know, that would be the idea. Stopping Skynet before they get into all this time fuckery would be... Would be a truly fantastic plan. And you go report back to Baron. Oh, I'll Speaking report back Baron. to Baron, all right, buddy. So I stole this chip because you asked me to. Tell... You, you know what? Tell me about Baron. What happened between you and Baron? Years ago, Connor gave an order to infect Skynet with a virus. Okay, do it, so y'all had a mission. T-800 model I was trying to reprogram. Let me guess. I warned them that I wasn't you failed. The Terminator was fully functional, but they didn't listen. So, as expected, it went online and sent our coordinates to Skynet. But not only that, it attacked... So Baron was with Perry. Mac reactivated a T-800 under orders, supposedly. An item. And it killed Perry. Well... Out of the two of you, I trust her a lot more because you've been sketchy, you're hyper paranoid, you're a weirdo, and you tried to kill me. Force me to run a gauntlet through an entire mansion full of TA-100s. Um, and Baron has been on my side and fought with me to try and take down Skynet. So, you know, I think I'm going to be a good soldier and do what I was told to do. I was carrying this for a reason, pal. Please, please think 
joke about it. I'm the only one that can stop Skynet. You need me. Yeah, well, unfortunately, didn't need you that badly. We already hit the codes. We unlocked the rest of the uh, plasma rifles, like this guy right here that I'm about to grab. But, like, you're a danger, dude. You are messing around with so much stuff that you absolutely cannot be trusted with. Like, that's, that's just a handsome boy right there. Look at this guy. He's in the mainframe. He's been hanging around in the Skynet mainframe, looking at their plans, doing all this stuff. Like, you just can't be trusted, dude. There was a pseudo-grep command in there. I love it when the commands are actually real. That makes me happy. So, let's take a look. This is our Plasma V96. But we now have... A damage 125 versus base damage 120. It's a fire rate of 425. Shots to overheat 15, shots to reload 28. I mean, this looks like our winner right here. So I'm going to remove the chips from this guy. And I'm going to plug probably the same set of chips into this guy. And from here, I mean we could increase the we can increase the magazine size. Or we could just push for higher damage. So we can get 125 plus 70 on this dude. Or we could get 125 plus 52 plus 14 rounds in the mag. Which that I actually think is what I want to do here. There's also the stability chip, but there's other things I think that would suit better. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we, we, we don't need to do that. Actually, no, I'm going to keep that. I, I was going to, I was going to get rid of that rifle. Um, but you know what? It can stay. It has served me well, and it's a good little backup weapon to uh good little backup weapon to our now main violet plasma rifle. Cause it uses red cells, but it's pretty decent. Yes, ma'am. It is. But I have some news for you. Go you ain't going like this. You ain't going like this one bit. Well, now, returning to base, resistance shelter. It turns out that the infiltrator that's been following me has been sent back in time through a time displacement equipment. It connected to Skynet and uploaded all its knowledge, causing them to learn at a geometric rate. I have a feeling this war will not last much longer. I hope not. I'm tired of war, guys. I'm exhausted with this. I just want it to be over. Is that so much to ask? Here's the man of the hour. Yeah, I'm a pretty cool dude. Sergeant, are you taking a tour with us? Yeah, sure, man. Why don't we schedule that for just a little bit later? For now, I gotta go see El Comandante. Alrighty, here we go now. Sometimes they drop you off inside this inner door here soldier sometimes they drop you off inside this inner door and sometimes they make you run down through the outside and well that's just swell repeat it back to me know your target and what's behind it and what else yep that's good advice I forgot know your target and what's behind it I'm about that there is uh that is a very wise way to live 
Now, I think we got all of the people that we like out of this shelter already. I went out of my way to try and convince everyone to leave. Let's see, what do I not need? So TC-2000R, like, I've got the TC-16. That can go away, and honestly, I think that can go away also. Plasma minigun. I feel like we should get a purple plasma, a violet, purple, pleb. I feel like we should get a violet plasma minigun uh, fairly soon. Actually, you know what? Let's, because I was, I was about to, I was about to sell him equipment with a bunch of pretty decent chips in it, wasn't I? No? Okay, the, the chipped ones he already had in his inventory. Alright. Don't listen to my defective brain. I got confused. This happens from time to time. Those times are quite frequent. Don't judge me. So what do we need to buy? What do we need to buy? I'm gonna buy... Alright, well, all your violet plasma cells is pretty expensive. All your red plasma cells also pretty expensive. So why don't I not worry about buying ammunition? I will focus instead on buying things like consumables. And all your crafting resources. Just all of those bitches. Every last one. Give me all the fabrics. Give me all the metals. This is the stuff I want. You got some real nice chips there, Armano. Oh. Oh, see, I... That's not actually a horrible price for a very, very good chip. And I feel like I'm rapidly approaching the point in this game where I might not be needing money that much longer. How much is a missile? All your missiles for 2400 Yep, that's a good deal. I could sell him, like, half my trip mines to recoup some of that cost. I feel like 18 trip mines is still probably a lot more than I need. I'm not hurting on the chips. I'll, I'll, I'll take that as it is. That gave us a whole lot of stuff. And, uh... A good idea, I think, here would be to see if I can't go about crafting some of this stuff. Alvin, what is up, my dude? They gave me a rifle? I don't even know how to use one. They said it's hot, but it doesn't seem hot to me at all. It's all right. You'll figure it out. You figure out which is the bang-bang end. You point it at the man and you pull the trigger. Realistically, it's pretty simple stuff, dog. All right, crafting is in here. I'm gonna make many, many plasma cell. So I'm gonna make like 300 more violet plasma cells. I can make 15 more of these tasty good med kits. You know, I don't see why I wouldn't make all the plasma cells. That seems good. So what are we looking at for ammo? 1200 violet, 1100 red. A whole bunch of missiles. A whole bunch of ancillary ammunition. Some medium caliber ammo that I don't need. Get out of my inventory. Am I carrying any shotgun shells? Because apparently I have terrible inventory management. Lord only knows. You know what I should have done? I should have got crafting four and then five. Before I did that. But I suppose I don't really mind. Level 28 is the max. And I've got everything that matters. I'm honestly super stocked on stuff. Yeah, that would have been smart of me. I could have made so much more ammunition. 
But you know what? I'm going to burn up all these resources because I don't think we'll be needing them in the future. So this was where Patrick was drawing on the walls. Little turd. But Ryan left. Jennifer left. I think Mark and Laura left. Um, Patrick left. I guess he took Maxie. Yeah, the new plasma rifles. With the unlocked codes. And I only shot one man to do it. And I didn't even have to shoot him in order to do it. I just shot him because she asked me to. Rivers, just when you thought shit couldn't get any more crazy, this happens. Okay, what's happening? So what now? What do we do? With the infiltrators coming out and news of a fucking time machine, Connor wants to finish this war fast. I think that would be prepared? wise. Nowhere near. That's why an all-out attack is our only option. Okay, an all-out attack managed to locate being our only option is pretty spicy. Turns out it's right under our nose. It's in the basement of the old Griffith Observatory. So we're moving Ooh. out. Old you building basement. Connor wants me to stay here to coordinate the attack. And his North Division is heading to stop Skynet from sending anything through the time displacement equipment. Okay. So this is it. So we're attacking him on two fronts. Seem that way. You better get all your things sorted. Take your time. You're leaving in a couple of hours. All right. Leaving in a couple hours. You got it, ma'am. Prepare for battle? I think I'm about as prepared for battle as I'm going to get. Got all the weapons. I've got all the gear. Got all the medical supplies. Yellowstone. Anybody watch Yellowstone? I haven't watched it yet, and a lot of people have uh, a lot of people have suggested it to me, but I ain't I ain't gone down that route just yet. You're still here. Jacob, you're moving out. You need to get the I fuck mean, out of here, bro. What about you? I'm part of a scavenging team now. Commander Baron gave us an order to get back to the shelter. You gotta run, dude. See Jennifer, can you tell her that? You okay. have to get out. Uh, where is she? The last time I saw her, she was upstairs. Y'all both have to get the hell out of here. And you gotta take Maxie. Okay, this is an emergency because if he doesn't leave... The stranger made it sound like something bad was gonna happen. And most importantly... Maxie. Maxie has to get out. Jennifer, where you at? Jennifer, where you at? Jen? Jen, Jen? Janunifer? Jafunitor? Jeturfenerf? Where are you hiding? Where are you, Jen? Do you are behind door number this? In here? Oh no, that's the turlet. I shouldn't be in somebody else's turlet. Close the door. Do you in here? Well, that's locked. Okay, I guess we're going this way. Jen? Where are you, Jen? Oh, the cannons. Roll the cannons. Where is Jennifer? Why is she so hard to find? Why is she hiding from me? It's your boy. The Jacob. The Jacob Rivers. Your guy. There you are. You have got to get out of here. Nice view. How did you find me? Oh, Patrick just walked through an entire building. It was like the only so. place that you could be. Right? No, he seems happy. How did he do on your first scavenging hunt together? Is he a grown up? Uh, Is he a big he boy now? Just be outside. A little too excited. Some drones spotted him. But I did it. I managed to protect him. Good Nothing job. Happened. You did it. On, you did it. You also scavenger's life can be. See, you'll make a great scavenging team. However, I'm you should scavenge it. somewhere else. And because of that, I was thinking... About leaving? <laughs> I don't have any secrets from you, do I? Yes, yeah. you really need to About do that. 
with Patrick. You and Patrick need to get the hell out of here. I think you should leave. What? Are you serious? Look. I thought you'd be the last person. I know some stuff. Though. What about what you Because said a here? dirty man in a dirty old hood told me some stuff. It's not safe here anymore and I think you should go. I'll sound crazy. I will sound almost as crazy as your crazy eyes make you look. Your opinion matters to me the most. To be honest, you're the only thing keeping me here. Well, cool, because I ain't going to be here much longer, bro. That's it then. I guess I'm going. Get, get, get. Go on. You're always looking out for me. Thank you for that. You good. I know you're moving out soon, but there's something I want to say. Well, say it quickly. Regardless of what happens later... I hope that we'll find each other. Thank you for yeah. being there for me. I'm lucky. I'm sure we will. I'm lucky to have you too. Oh. Oh, I think it's going to be one of those scenes. You know what? I have been Cade. This has been Terminator Resistance. Thank you so much for joining me, and I'll see you next time.